Hey everyone, and welcome back to the galaxy. Today, we will be learning about three completely free programs that will help you kickstart your digital design experimentation or career. We will go over free software as well as their industry standard matches. GIMP. If you've been following this channel, GIMP makes up a large portion of what we teach. It stands for GNU, Image Manipulation Program. Its functionality is very similar to that of Photoshop and can often produce the same results. Its interface will get you accustomed to the modular format of industry standard software, how layers and layer masks work, blend modes, and what different filters do. You'll start to understand industry jargon as you navigate through this program and create your own designs. GIMP is good for art, image manipulation, and basic layouts. It does not deal with vectors. Click the card in the top right hand corner to be taken to our GIMP tutorial playlist. Inkscape. Inkscape is akin to Adobe Illustrator. This software uses vectors to create designs. Vectors are crystal clear at all sizes digitally and are a good option for large-scale designs or illustrations. If you are passionate about branding, layouts, and pixel-perfect designs, Inkscape is a great starting point for you. You'll get experience creating complex shapes with the pen tool, experimenting with fills and strokes, merging and subtracting shapes, and creating crystal clear line work and designs. Blender. 3D design is trending and is a good skill to develop. Blender allows you to familiarize yourself with that space with incredibly powerful modeling, texturing, and compositing capabilities. Blender has a vibrant, passionate community that is always adding new features. It is becoming a more industry standard tool with companies recognizing its power and ingenuity. If you want to get into 3D modeling, sculpting, and game development, Blender is a great software to learn. You'll get experience using vertices, faces, and edges, sculpting tools, modifiers, compositing chains, texturing, and more. Blender is comparative to Cinema 4D and ZBrush. While most of these programs aren't standardly used in the corporate digital design space, they are a good stepping stone to familiarize yourself with design interfaces, processes, and design experimentation. Links to all the software we discussed today are in the description. Happy designing, and thanks for watching.